on a train track ever again in my whole life. What's up, P Nation? We are in our sketchy Airbnb and we are about to leave to go to Kiev. So we're taking a third class train from Odessa, Ukraine on the Black Sea all the way to Kiev, the capital of Ukraine. And it's not air conditioning and it's gonna be maybe hot. I don't really know. It's gonna be very interesting. We're excited to show you guys all things that third class trains have to offer here in Ukraine. But first, we gotta catch our Uber. There are so many locks on this thing. Oh my gosh. Every day before we go out, there we go. Like that we made it to the train station we are a little early for our train however we do not have any water which is probably an issue because we normally drink a lot of water and this train day is 11 hours yep. so we're gonna try and get on the train and then i'm gonna try and run to a convenience store and hopefully i can make it back in time yep. to not miss the train with Leah on it Our train car is like almost at the very end. So we decided that I would wait in the middle here and Zach would run and get four waters. Hopefully that's enough to last us through the day. And then he'll come back and then we'll get on the cart. Third class train isn't set up like most trains. It's like there's two bunks and then there's one on the side next to the window. So we're here on the side, up, one's above the other. And hopefully we can sit together. We don't really know what's going on. There he is. Our champion, our champion of water. Ooh, this train is ridiculously big. We have to walk like a quarter of a mile all the way to the last car, car number 15. sweating today but we just had to walk like a mile we ran we probably shouldn't have come this late but yeah we're here now we're gonna sweat for the next 11 hours so we're trying to stay hydrated okay so i was wondering how you're gonna fit all these people in such a small area but this train car is the same size as our second class one which wasn't that roomy so what they did was made these beds a lot smaller i've heard stories that people fall off of these beds really easily and i can totally see why it's barely wide enough i don't think it's wide enough for my shoulder <laughs> And we're moving right on time. I originally was like, we shouldn't be in this area. We wanted us to be on that side, like right next to each other so we could see. And then I saw that this area had like a seating place. So like we could sit here comfortably the whole ride and one person can lay up if they're tired. Okay, just to give you some insight, it is really hot on here. However, they do give you like sheets and bedding, which last time we didn't put on because our beds are pretty nice. But now they're looking a little more used. So it's basically just like a pack of two sheets, one for putting down, one for putting on top of you, some like padding, and then like a cover to put over your pillow and a hand towel for when you sweat. It's like really small, so I can't sit up in here, but it's pretty relaxing and it's a lot cooler today than I thought it would be. Okay, so we have stopped for the first time. We are six hours in. On our last train we went on, we stopped like five times so this is a lot different than that one there's like no one outside selling anything either so i'm thinking this like the express train straight to camp okay so we came from odessa all the way over here and we are finally turning towards kiev 
so we've come to a stop and everything's gotten a little bit hotter in here but we wanted to tell you guys that this mode of transportation in a third class cabin is very inexpensive we spent eight us dollars each for our tickets to get all the way from the black sea all the way to kiev that's such a far ride and the train we took to odessa which was the second class cabin was 25 dollars each yeah it's a little bit nicer but it's still the same temperature there's no air conditioning anywhere so like this is really the way to go Another rainstorm. We got to Odessa, we avoided a storm, yes. and it's just really nice here. It is. You know, this whole experience has really taught me something. I will never walk on a train track ever again in my whole life. What? Because poop falls directly on the tracks. And you know, I'm just sorry if that's a little graphic. It's just not something that I'm willing to put myself well, through. I, I didn't know it happened until just now, too. So. <laughs> but you know, lessons you learn from travel. is absolutely gigantic. We are now getting into an Uber that only costs $1.50 to go across the city. And just like that, we made, we it. made it to the center of town. This is going to be amazing. We haven't been in a city this big since we were in Southeast Asia. Think so? Yeah. Hey, we made it in the first part of three parts. Okay, so it wasn't in this building. Apparently, it's in another building across the street. Going up to the third floor. Room tour! So we're here in Kiev, and this is our apartment. We have an actual kitchen with all the stuff and all the things, and we're gonna make so many good meals in here. And what's crazy about this place is that it has really high ceilings. I feel like we're in a museum, and we have two bedrooms. Not one, but two. A whole bedroom, seating area, big TV, and a second bedroom, which we've never had before. So for our friend that's coming to visit us tomorrow, he has his own bedroom, that's crazy. And we have a huge bathroom and a washing machine. It's great, it's gonna be great, everything's great. We're gonna have so much fun here in Kiev. So excited because the last place we stayed was super sketchy, so now I get to like relax. And we have a balcony. Thank you so much for watching this video. I know the Airbnb parts are like, what are you doing? But we just feel like we want to pass the mental test. You go through like a strenuous sure. day of 11 hour um, train travel, and then you get to the ultimate destination, and it's like, okay, now we got to do like three different doors, get the key from this yeah, place, go to this place, hunt. go on a third yeah. floor. Does this even lock this door? Like, what's going on? So that's why we show you that part because it's really interesting to us. So tell us if you don't like it or if you do like it in the comment section below. It's not but really thank you. interesting. It's hard and difficult. I think it's interesting. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. It was really nice to do the train today. Yeah, it was. It's our last Ukraine train and it was amazing. Mm -hmm.